What's up, YouTube? This Rose Gold back with another video. Now, check it out. Gog and Magog, right? That's in the Bible, people. There will be wars and rumors of wars, right? Let's take this up a notch. China and India ready for war. This is what's going around, people. China and India allegedly are ready for war against each other. Against each other. So, they're saying that the money, the money is getting low out here, people. And it's causing chaos. Yeah, because when you, when you having all these wars, then, you know, it's a lot of money in there. It's big business for whoever get the benefit from a war. First of all, you know what I'm saying? And, 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 and it costs a lot to maintain the war to keep going. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, it costs a lot to keep that maintained and keep going. And so, you know, that's kind of scary. Especially when they're talking about money. Especially when they're talking about lives. You know, people that ain't got nothing to do with nothing don't even want this happening. Like myself and you. Okay? So, Gog and Magog, is this, is this, is this what we're going to be witnessing people? We already got a war that's going on that's similar to... Uh, when Hitler invaded Poland, right? And now you got China, allegedly, or India, allegedly, trying to invade each other. I don't know which one going to draw first. You see? So, stock up on your stuff. That's all, that's all I can say. You know, stock up on food and stuff like that. Everything you need, man. Anything you could possibly think of, all right? Stock up on it. Because the prices is going to go sky high on certain stuff, people. On all stuff in a minute, if you think about it. I, I, I can't even imagine what the price is going to be in June and July. You know what I'm saying? Just off gas alone. So, that's what I'm saying, people. That's why I got on here to tell y'all. Because it's looking like China and India might have something going on that, that, that ain't nobody paying attention to right at this moment. All right, and and we ain't, and I ain't got to keep talking about uh, Russia and uh, Ukraine at this point in time right now because we already know what they doing over there. Disastrous stuff, disastrous stuff, people that I couldn't even imagine what them people going through over there. You know what I'm saying? Which is none of my business. You see, ain't none of my business, people. I'm over here. And it ain't none, none of Biden business. But see, it's always America business as well. You know why? Because of this money. Everybody's money is tied to something. And America money, that's what keeps other countries poor. Keep them, you know, down. Down one. You see what I'm saying? So, because United States has the number one currency at the moment. Because see, to, see, that's what a lot of this, see, it's always about money. So, they, t they, they, uh, you know, they're going to get tired. Well, they probably already tired of the dollar being, you know, the best currency and whatnot. You feel me? So, shoot, what better us to do with that? Get rid of all money from every country. You see what I'm saying? And make it one global money. Then, then can't nobody complain. See, see, that cuts that down. Can't nobody complain because it's universal. People arguing about people arguing about who Jesus is and 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 that ain't the right one. It's this one over here and it's and that ain't the right one either. It's this one over here and go on and on, right? So they said, "Oh, we gonna cut down the confusion and make it just one religion." Then ain't nobody got nothing to argue about, right? Right. <laughs> this is what this this is what these people are trying to do, people. All right, oh, one world government. All right, one world order. A new world order. You know what I'm saying? We already under a one world order as far as, well, I'll just say a world order. You know what I'm saying? Because it's multiple at this time. You see what I'm saying? But what they trying to do is get a global, you know, a one world order, a new world order. So, yeah, because they have a world order going on right now. It's always been one, but they've never had everybody up under one world government. All right, and then see, see when all this, see now I get what the Bible was saying about when, you know, it's gonna be somebody coming in. They call him the Antichrist, and he's gonna be saying peace, peace, because that's the only thing. 
think about it. that's it. like if this stuff get you know go any further and it becomes a world war it's go, it's going to be the most drastic war ever in the history of mankind all right this will be probably the last one but it's going to be disastrous you see what i'm saying so with that being said it's gonna it's gonna have to be somebody to come in that everybody's gonna uh you know bow down to so to speak you know because because nobody's gonna go for biden nobody's gonna go for the china president nobody's gonna go for putin you know what i'm saying nobody's gonna do all that it's gonna be somebody we ain't probably ain't even never seen before or somebody you would thought that wasn't that and allegedly you know hey i ain't gonna get too deep in that who it could be but i'm just saying all right that's another that's another video right so they, you know what I'm saying? They out here like, yeah, it's gonna be somebody to come in and try and not try to bring peace. Peace. They will bring peace. All right. They will bring peace. And then there's your antichrist right there. You know what I'm saying? And this is a person that's against Christ. Against you know, if you religion, religious, they're gonna be against your Christ because they want you to fall to them as if they're God. You feel me? So yeah, man, it's it's like a damn uh twilight zone up in this joint in 2022. This is old twilight zone zone. 2023, what is it gonna be? You know what I'm saying? A lot of more craziness, people. And that's why I got on here to tell y'all China and India, India are ready for war. So they say. Alright. Gog and Magog. So we're witnessing this at this time of this generation, people. We are the witnesses of what is going on. The ones they said in the Bible that were witnesses, th witness this is us, <laughs> all right? So that's what I'm trying to get you to think. Go out there and get your stuff. I know, because today, it's a nice day again out here. You, you know, that make you just don't even want to think about, man, that's them over there. I get it. Trust me, I get it. I still enjoy my day now. Message. You know what I'm saying? It's just, you got to think, though. You got to realize, too, come on back home now. Uh, this stuff is going down. It ain't no way around it, people. So keep your eye on your bank funds. You know what I'm saying? Keep your eyes on it as if you doing stocks and stocks and trades. You see, me? You see what I'm saying? <laughs> keep your eye on your prize. And that's your money right about now. Keep your eye on your money. You know what I'm saying? And uh, make sure, you know, stuff in your home is secure with what you need people don't be one of these people that's without you better start getting your stuff all right i ain't i ain't nah, shit i'll be saying i ain't gonna stress it no more but i got to because it's the truth get your stuff get your stuff people all right so uh y'all have a good thursday you know what i'm saying uh i just got on here to share that with y'all man salute to everybody all my subscribers much love man message 